Hey YouTube, what's going on? It's Kid Collector 11 in with a sick nasty absolute mojo recap video. Um, yeah, sick stuff. Uh, I was at the Philly car show this weekend. I uh, didn't really expect to go, but I got some uh, three Hall of Fame uh, autographs. Um, and I'm just gonna be showing you some mail that I've gotten in like within the past three weeks. Not all of it. Um, cause I haven't made a video in all, that's cause I actually moved, uh, to a new house. So, uh, it's a successful move, and hopefully I'll be making videos more often now. I mean, I keep, seem to be going on these spurs where I make a lot of videos, and then I don't, and then I do, and then I don't, like, so on. Um, yeah, but I'll just start with the stuff that I've been getting in recently. Um. One, or I forget who these are from, I'm sorry, but if you're watching this, but uh, this one, a Luke Hochevar, a rookie autograph out of 50. I think that he's a pretty good pitcher. Um, he's not the best, but I mean, I think that he's pretty cool. And then this one is just super sick. It's my first Jersey autograph card. Um, and this is one of the guys who I have like the most respect of in the league. Because um, he's supposedly the hardest worker in the MLB, and I don't really buy that. But I mean, he's not a bad pitcher, but he just hasn't been on a good team really ever. All right, 2005 Don Zenith, uh, Yvonne Hernandez jersey autograph. Out of a hundred, so that's that's nice. I'm a, I'm a fan of him. Um, Alright, and then these, I do remember who these are from. These are from um, Man Kyle, Sports Card Fan 32. Uh, first, I bought these cards off of him. Ken Griffey Jr. rookie card. I got a good price on these. And uh, Tony Wynn rookie card. Yeah. Tony Wynn from my PC. Uh, this one. Bought off eBay for cheap, not that cheap, but it was, it was all right. Um, I was a little disappointed, but Roy Oswalt, Sweet Spot Autograph, um, Autograph, Sweet Spot. Um, now look at this. I was never notified of this. These little black marks on the foil, but other than that, it's nice. I mean, the corners are pretty good. Pretty good. They're not the best, but... There's they're still quality corners. Oh, uh, all right. Um, and I actually got this in the same night as that. Let me just find it. Here you go. Put it in that magnetic because it's a Hall of Fame autograph. One of the four I'll be showing you. Right, here we go. Player I did not have an autograph of. Yeah. Hellshire Heroes. Frank Robinson, autograph. Now I'll leave my collection because he's Hall of Fame PC. I'm actually made the mistake of trading a Willie Starzl autograph. I mean, I just filled in some cards because the top loader, the magnetic stick. But I still see the face of the card. Yeah, I traded my Willie Starzl autograph. Oh, and I'll show you what I got for that. Um, Mike, uh, I got a Mike Stanton for it. I can't show you that because it's gone now, but. Whatever. Um, and if you wanted to see it, uh, the certificate for the Frank Robinson. Pretty nice. Um, let's see. La, la, la. All right. So now onto the card show recap. Mojo stuff. Mojo, mojo, mojo. Uh, two deceased players. Um, and one guy who's on the Phillies. And this card's just sweet. Um, I'll start with the lowest end card. Chris Young autograph. I didn't buy it for three bucks. I did. I don't know. I'm not sure. Um, but it was a good price. I don't know what that was though. Um, Chris Young. Blue autograph. That's sweet. I think it's TTM or in person. But he's a he's an all right player. So averages. Two thirty eight career average. That's not that good. But if I resell sell it, I'll sell it for like four bucks. I mean. I think that's what I bought it for. I bought it for four. And this is on the 
Yeah, it's on the penny sleeve. Um, let me see. This, I bought this for five bucks. Sweet. The Hawk, Andre Dawson autograph. 2010 Hall of Fame. Corners are pretty cr These two aren't the best, the ones, these two. The back's perfectly clean. Other than that, it's great. Um, I don't know what one to show you. Three magnetics. Choose this one. All right, this one's Hall of Fame once again. Another Nabisco, uh, geez. Nabisco Hall of Fame autograph, just like my Star Joel, but I don't have the Star Joel anymore, which kind of bothers me. Here we go, slide. The cease player, number one. Jim Catfish Hunter. Six, 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 sick mojo. Cause he's dead. Um, and there's, and there's the certificate. I'm an addition autograph trading card, Jim Catfish Hunter. I love this product because they have all the Hall of Famers. Um, and I think they look nice. They're all in-game action shots. Um, my stars will look dirty. Um, what are you gonna do though? I mean, I'm, 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 as you can tell, I'm, I'm really bummed out about that. All right, here's what I got for the mic stand, which I traded for. I traded the Star away for the mic stand, and I don't know. I, I think I got a good deal in the end. I mean, the Star Joel. Star Joel is a pretty good law or a pretty big loss, but this is a pretty big gain. All right, here we go. Phillies player. Former PC, Chase Utley. Chase the man. That's a sick and nasty card right there. Um, I'm definitely not trading there because it's my first Utley autograph and the corners are perfect when I, before I put in the magnetic. They were clean as a whistle. Sick autograph. That's dirty mojo right there. And this one, I mean, it was debatable whether I actually put this last. Um, but here it goes. Deceased player number two. This guy's an old timer. So here we go. Old time player. Johnny Mize. Look at this dude. The man. <sighs> um, stamped for the win 408 of 2000. Johnny Mize autograph. Certified on the back. That's sick and nasty stuff. Alright, I'm gonna make, make a for trader for sale video or for sale, probably for sale, because I need some I'm looking at something right now. Um anyway. Thanks YouTube. Uh see you guys later. Peace out, subscribe.